guys, so I am back from California and I have to say we did a lot of shopping. But as a disclaimer, I graduated high school and my high school was a uniform school so I'm going from wearing uniform to wearing like casual clothes every day of the week. So it's like I need like five times the outfits because I have five more, you know what I mean? Like I have five more days that I have to dress for so I need more clothes, right? Yes. That, that's my disclaimer. <laughs> that's, what, that's what we're leaving it at. <laughs> right on. Um, just quickly before we start, before my trip, I bought, I made an AliExpress order and I got a couple phone cases. I got this one that has Stitch on it, which is cute. It's very protective, guys. <laughs> I also bought this one here, which has um, black and white elephant um, with a Aztec print. And then I put a love handle on that one. And then I have a Dreamcatcher one. And then I also bought this, which is a puff for my keychain, though this is the wrong color, it was supposed to be black, so we'll see what happens with that. So yeah, let's just jump into the things I bought on vacation. So one of the first things I bought was this Dreamcatcher. I got this in San Diego at the Old Town. So as soon as you enter the Old Town on your right hand side, there should be um, like a little Not really a, like a mini like mall, but it's not really a mall with stores. It has like little booths with um. So this is like the booth all the way at the end. If you like enter through the front of the store and you walk all the way to the end, it was on your right hand side. Um, and it's just a blue one. It was four dollars, and it has a little bit of string detail, which is what I wanted. I wanted some string because a lot of them were all beads, and it's just blue because it'll match the color of my new room. I'm a big fan of dream catchers. This is the one I have in my current room now because it just matches this color scheme. I'm going blue with my other room, so this will match that color scheme. Um, but I do have. <laughs> I am a crazy sleeper, so hope that is, I just I do believe in dream catchers greatly. Next, I'm not going in any specific order because I just have lots of stuff. I bought this from Nordstrom Rack. It is the Too Faced Airbrush um, Airbrush Air Buffed. BB cream. Um, I got the shade Vanilla Glow. It's just a little lighter than my skin right now because I am very tanned. <laughs> Doesn't look like it in the viewfinder, but like tan line. Guys, I'm tanned. Okay. Um, so, but this will be more of a match for me in the fall when I still have a little bit of color, but I'm paler. This was seven dollars and ninety nine ninety seven cents. I was like, oh, so I'm so excited to have this. Um, and it comes with a little brush on top too. I know I'm speaking really fast, that's because I have 20 minutes left to film this video before I have to leave, so just kind of getting it all in there. And then on this vacation we made two trips to Alta. Two trips to Alta. The first time I bought two things, second time I bought two things, and then we got a free gift. Um, so the first thing I bought was the Lorac Pro Palette. I am in love, this thing is amazing. Um, at first I really wanted the Kat Von D one and then Jim Loves Reviews was like, eh, it doesn't stay on your face. So I'm like, okay. Then maybe I'll get the Anastasia one. But the, uh, the colors of the Anastasia one, but just not my cup of tea. This one I actually use every single color in here. Ooh, big mirror. Um, I use this to contour my jawline. If you guys watch my vlogs, I mentioned that a couple times. And then a mixture of these depending on how I feel. Um, as a contour, I can use yellow and beige highlight to set my face. And then I use shimmer as a highlight, like down my typical highlighting spots. So in love with that. Um, on that same trip from Ulta, I picked, finally picked up the Revel in color Say This has been raved about so much, so I'm excited to actually try it now. I got the color Warm Golden. And then on my second trip to Ulta, I picked up two lip products because... I got two face products and two lip products. Um, the first one I am in love with, this is the Maybelline Color Blur by Lip Studio in the color 15 Berry Misbehaved. So what it is, is that you're supposed to color in the big, uh, middle of your lips and then use this end, which is like this rubber piece to blend it outwards. So it looks kind of like a popsicle kind of look. It is gorgeous like that or even all over your lips. It is beautiful. I am in love with this. Then I got Blake's Red, which is all sold out in here in Canada, so like, I'm excited to actually, well not here in Canada, but in the stores near me, so I'm excited to, it is a gorgeous 
deep blue tone oh my god it makes your teeth look so white lipstick i am in love like lively's color from l'oreal if you guys were wondering and then if you bought twenty dollars worth of you bought twenty dollars worth of ulta products you got things from ulta so i'm just gonna go through it quickly you get a glitter eyeshadow top coat a lipstick in basically berry a mascara a dual ended eyeliner a mineral lip gloss in sheer opal a brow tint and then the rest and then three eyeshadows in like quads and then a blush highlighter dual duo in sunkist and then you also got brushes oh and there's a nail polish in here too you also got brushes and then there was something else i can't remember um and the nail polish is in bittersweet so that's all the makeup i got on this trip very reserved i know my dad doesn't agree with that though i don't know how to start okay i'm gonna start off with whatever i reach it's not gonna be in any specific order um so from tj maxx i got a couple things i got this superman shirt this is gonna be a pajama top because it's a little bit big it was from the men's section it's a medium so i'm gonna wear that as a pajama and this was like eight bucks and then that day i was wearing a pair of shorts that were like woof where did those come from? Those are really short. I those even mine. Um, so I really wanted to grab a pair of shorts just to change into. So I grabbed this pair because this was the only shorts in my size that they had. Um, and that was $9.99. And then I had one more shirt from that trip. Okay, but there's more. We'll just continue with this. Um, also from TJ Maxx, it was $9.99. It's this shirt that says, um, Weekend, I Love You. It's super baggy. And I can wear it till the weekend. Next, I got this shirt. You guys are going to see a very common trend with my shirts. This is just a baseball tee, but it has more of a flowy bottom on it. This is cute. <laughs> then I have just a plain black loose tee. And this one was on clearance for $6. And then we got, I got this bright cobalt tee. And this one was eight dollars they were very good price oh wait oh wait and there's a little pocket there and then i got this nice little black flowy shirt and this was ten dollars and this is really cute okay that's all i have for tj maxx for now we're gonna hold off on that for later i did get one thing from urban behavior because it was cheap it was ten bucks it was this t-shirt I was so excited because I really wanted one of their plaid shirts, but they're like $70. <laughs> so I got this instead. Um, I got a pair of jeans from Lucky Brand, and this is my first pair of like fancy jeans. Um, but they were $25. Like, they were $50 marked down. Originally, $120 marked down to $50, and then they were 50% off the ticketed price. So I got a pair of just dark wash jeans. And then we went to this store called Love Couture, I think. Heavenly Couture. That, that. We went to a store called Heavenly Couture, and I picked up several things from there. So did my mom. We spent a couple hours there. So the first thing is this dress. It has, like, a square print on it, as you may see. And it has, like, a double layer at the top, and then it just flows down. And the back has, like, a T-strap there. So I think this will be really cute. And then the way the mannequin had that styled, it had this... Um, kimono on top of which I wore when we were in Vegas and I ripped it so my mom has to fix that for me um, I just ripped part of the fringe off the bottom there on the side here but it is just this velvety black um, fringy kimono which I adore then I got this romper this is a black one I thought it was very chic it has an open back I wore this when we were in Palm Springs and it has just like a lacy part on the beam really like that then I got the sweater because my school actually has like in part of the library it has like a pirate fire pit in it so I thought this would be really cute with like a pair of shorts and tank top and we're sitting around the fireplace studying so I thought this would be cute it's just a cardigan that has like this very aztec -y print then I got this shirt which is like one of the Brandy Melville shirt dresses Again, I wore this. When did I wear this? 
I, I wore this and I got a stain on it. Oh, I wore this to the Grand Canyon. That's where I wore this. And it's just this striped, um, where the sleeves are tight and it's just long and you just, I just wear it with like a pair of Lululemon shorts. Lululemon, lemon. <laughs> I'm talking really quickly. 12, 18. And then I picked up this romper, which is just this really comfy blue one. It's so soft. Um, what material is this? I don't even know if it'll say. Oh, it's rayon and spandex. So it's very like just count like comfy lounging around. So I like that. Okay, that's what I got from there. Anything else? Oh, I also got this jacket. This is a jean jacket. Everything that store by the way was $16.95 and over. So I got like a nice, a really nice jean jacket for like 16 bucks. Like what? So I got that from there. I think that's everything I got from Heavenly Couture. They had a buy one get one half off sale, so I picked up two pairs of the same shoes. Um, first one is just a purple pair, and I like these. I wore these in Vegas. I got some kind of weird food stain on it. Don't know where that's from. And I also got a black pair. And the original pair of shoes that I was looking at was black, um, exactly like this, but with black laces. So then I'm like, but. These were like $15 cheaper. So I'm like, okay, I can just buy these and then spend $2 and get a pair of laces, which is what I did. And then we went to PacSun and PacSun was having like a great deal. It was buy six, get two free. And Daniel was being a really like shit disturber. He just came in, he's sitting on the bed now and he wouldn't want to get anything. So, oh, I found more TJ Maxx, hold on. I also got this shirt from TJ Maxx. It says Dreamer on it and it has elephants. I like elephants. And then I got this shirt from Marshalls. This is different. And this is just a slightly less burgundy tea. I bought a lot of things. Oh, and I bought a Captain America version of the Superman shirt. And if you guys watch my vlogs, you guys know I wear my Captain America pajama top a lot. And this will be, this is tighter so I can wear it as like an actual top. It's different though, so you can't tell I'm wearing the same thing. Okay, so now in the pack sun. I ended up buying seven things, my sister got one thing and my dad got one thing and it ended up being like $60 for like all this stuff. I'm like, oh. Okay, so I got first this L shirt, which looks really cute on. The original price on this one is $25. Then I got this sweater, which this is what my dad picked out and at first I was like, eh, but it looked pretty cute on so I was like, why not? And this one was $45. And has little fringes. He's like, fringes really in. I'm like, yeah, Dad, I know that. Thank you for that memo. Then I got just this basic um, cream tea, or it's Heather Oat colored. And this one's originally $17. You know, tea. And then I got this one, which I'm gonna use as a pajama top. It just has cameras printed all over it. The price tag is not on it, so who knows what the original price is. Then I got this. This is the only thing that wasn't a part of the sale, but since we saved so much money, but as I find, just get it. Um, this is from the Kendall and Kylie collection. It was $35, and it's just like a sweater turtleneck with no sleeves. My dad's like, what are you going to wear that for? If Because if we were in Palm Springs at the time, he's like, if you wear it here, it's going to be too hot. If you wear it at home, it's going to be too cold. I'm like, I'll make it work. Because I thought it was just so cute and looked so good on, so I'm excited for that. And then I got this sweater, which is originally 50 bucks. And it's just this cream color sweater. And then I got this gray one, which I don't know how this fit, but it fit perfectly. And this one has like a slight pull in the back, but my dad's like, oh, you probably can just fix that. And so this one's originally $50 too. Just like that. Okay, so I think that's all I got. I don't think I'm forgetting everything. I put everything in a pile so I can show you guys. And that is it. Now I gotta leave and go to Daniel's Wonderland and pick up my cousin and, you know, do all that fun stuff. So I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Daniel, do you wanna come say bye? Fuck you. He's a pleasant one. Okay, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.